All right, let's talk about these gold wands today. So if you guys have already not know about this is boom. Radiance Goblin's Magic Wand. This is a super big wand that gives you super good loot. A mystery, a mysterious wand, magic wand that opens the entrance that leads to the huge Goblin Secret Warehouse. Opening the Discover Entrance will require a large area. So what this is, is that it takes 10 of these re re regular go Goblin Rods to combine into this one. So how to combine it is you do need to go into a... I think it's... Yeah, I think it's alchemy table, isn't it? Alchemy. Alchemy. Hello? Is it not you? I guess oh, no. Yeah, yeah, it's right here. I'm blind. So, yeah. The Radiant Goblin Magic Wand. So, you need 10 of it to get this one here. And there's a chance for great success. So, what great success do for you here in alchemy is that if you get great success, you get two of it. So, mine's only 4% uh, right now, which is pretty bad. But, regardless, it's fine. It is fine for now. Can I do something real quick though? Can I do something real quick to get this up? Do you want to get up? Iron clean? Why not? Should I do some clean with this? Oh, uh, whatever. Not too big of a deal. I will take care of it later. All right. So whatever. So let's get our rod. Let's get two of it. Great success, please. Four percent chance. Nah, of course I didn't get it. So now I have five of these. These gives you really, really good gold. Each one of these, uh, on average, gives you over 400k gold and also a bunch of good crystals for looting. So the main thing, so but before you use this, you want to make sure you're stacking up on your gold buff, right? Because gold buff applies. So I have the the radiant, uh, the radiant buff, the radiant goddess blessing, which gives me 20% gold. The what's we got? Gold increase elixir gives me another 20%. So 40% increase in gold. And there is a upcoming hot time for this, which will give you another 20% increase in gold. So I will have a 60% total gold increase if I were to do this within the hot time. But I'm not going to because I do not have the time during hot time. During hot time, I'll, I'll be grinding uh, condensed lightning for some money. So I'll do this now. So uh, people said that Radiant Goblin Magic Wand, you guys, if you were to open it, you can't go into it uh, uh, other players cannot go into it so but i don't know if that's true or not let's go back to my previous location yeah guild guild hideout is really efficient there is all the crafting stations there oh eevee will appear one minute whatever i got myself i want anyways so whatever uh, let's do it here let's actually no people here is farming eevee i need to go where do I, want to go? I should go here. I should go here. This is a good spot. This is it. I should, let's go here. Why not? Why not? If someone comes and take it, then whatever. Not too big of a deal for me. I will just hunt them down later. So uh, let me see if I have any more gold buffs I can use. I don't think that's it. I have all the gold buffs. So I'm currently I'm running on 40% buffs. So let's give this a try. Boom. Jump in here. Put that on auto, on auto. Oh, wait. Before I do that, I'm going to use my drop rates. Yeah. But a 10% increase drop rate. So that means that there's a higher chance of me getting... Uh, there's a higher chance of me getting the better uh, the better loot within the chest. So as you can see, there's a lot of loot here. Oh, wait. I should probably comment. So I started off... Oh, I just got like 100k or something. So I started off at 11,500,000. Uh, 11, Let's see how much we get. Look at that. That's a lot of gold. And look at that. We got, I got a ruby here. I got some crystals. A bunch of crystals. Super nice. Crystals are super rare. This one's a monster. Oh, what the heck? It's not a monster. Nice, nice. Yeah, it's so easy too because there's not that many monsters here. Like these are all going is going to be chests and then you have the goblin, of course. So super nice. Super easy. Got another gold. I'll come in right now. Look at that. I, I already got uh, up 300k already. That's nuts. And the thing about this is that it's a small area, but all of your loot is compact. So it's super fast. It's way more efficient than farming 10 of it at once. Ooh, each one of this chest gives you a lot of stuff. The raw crystals. You do need a lot of the raw crystals for, ma for making your sculptor sets.
Look at that. I'm already up 600k already. That's nuts. That is nuts. And I'm missing a chest. Uh, don't, don't leave. Do not leave until you get notified that you got it in every single chest. Because the game will tell you. The game will tell you when you get every single chest. Is this one that I missed? Most positive is one that I missed. Did, I... Did the game not notify me? Is there a bug? I... Oh, there it is. Oh my god, thank god it's not a bug. Nice. Yeah. So the game will tell you once you clear everything. So, so if the game didn't say clear, then do not leave the dungeon. You are obviously missing one chest somewhere. So let's take let's take a look at that. Let's see what was the profit. Six hundred and seventy k. Wow. So let's keep going, right? Let's do all. This. See how much money we make. I make so much money. All right. Now we got a lead. So we know that we started off this much. So let's see how much we get. Boom. Money, money. And the thing is, not just that, right? Like I said, you get these items like this right here. I got I got this gold chunk. I got this frag, golden fabric. I got razor sharp claw, some random loot in here. Splinter gold. And then, yeah, look at this. Seven of this. Eight, three, four, and five. I got so many of this. That's nuts. And then this 15 of these crystals alone. What is that one thing? Because you do need raw crystals. Because you do need uh 100 of the, the regular crystals to expand your sculptor set for that is important. I uh, uh, do you want a controller guide? Do you want a controller guide? Because he isn't smart. AI is not that smart. Get over here. Ooh, look at that purple crystal. Ooh, that's a lot of crystal on that one. Yeah, 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 look at all that. That's money. This is money, dude. I wish, dude, I wish I can live in a house like this, dude. There's money everywhere. This should be an option. They should actually release a house, which is, which, which is, looks like a cave with all this money. I'll just decorate it. That'd be pretty sweet. I'm a money lover after all. Everything's about profit. Yo, I'm out here trying to profit everything. Boom, boom. What's right right now? Ooh, that's a nice 550k increase. Can I get my codex? What's not his trophy? Not 700. It's not bad. Codex. What I got for my codex here? Rocks, mountains. And here we go. Ooh, 125k. All right. Remember that, guys, to subtract that from there. Yeah, not bad. This is a nice clean everything. Wow, this is not bad. This was like what? The last one was like 700k. 700k from one single rod that's almost a mil imagine if you stack that with another 20 percent you can probably get in like like 800 or 900k even it's pretty nice let's do one more rod. so much more we can get from the last one i want a big haul so there's still one more theory is that if we can get a, be a better place because currently all the rods i've been using is always the same place i wonder if there's like a just a throne room honestly dude where the go where there's a goblin king that has all my loot. What the hell? He opened chest from a stair. Yeah, definitely uh combine your rod. Save up all your got your goblin rod and combine it. Because this gives you much more resources and it's faster too. Imagine having to do the other one ten times. That'd be a pain in the ass. Ooh, go pick up the loot. Okay, nice. Forgot my I have my buddy, my helmet skeleton picking up everything. Honestly, I should give him a name. I didn't name him yet. I should probably give him a name. All right, we'll call him Gold. Gold Bones. Wait, I can't. There's no space. Oh, I can't space. Well, he's gonna be called Gold, I guess. All right. How much am I get this one? Ooh, not bad at all. Not bad. Okay, I'm missing another box here. I thought I seen a box here, did I? Or, oh wait, oh my God, so much more here. Dude, wait, this might be my most one I get. 
yeah, I'm already up 700k in this one. And I still got three more. One, two, and then one more skeleton. Uh, not skeleton. One more goblin there. Where is this goblin? I saw some. I knew I saw a goblin here somewhere. I just seen him. Where could he go on? Oh, wait, I see him. He's up here. Nice. Clear that. Let's see what we get here. That might be the biggest haul. I mean, in gold, anyway, in terms of gold, anyways. All right, so that's it, though. I'm, I'm, I'm going to save my, my other two for something much. Wait for a better time when I can spend more gold on it. But for now, I'm fine. So, yeah, that one's pretty good. Cool. That, was, that one's 800K right there. So, alone, I got some, what, almost, like, close to 3 mil from just opening three of the Goblin uh, Wand with my 40% gold boots that I currently have. And it's not just that, right? I also have obtained uh this golden fragment golden chunks i got a bunch of gold splinter these, these sells for a lot currently in the market so but then again i do need it for myself as well and then we got look all these jewelries 14 13 12 11 10 all five of these jewelries sell for a lot of money as well but but uh you do need to use it for crafting so do keep it for yourself yeah so this is how you will want to use the goblin wand just make sure that when you do open it uh you are stacking your gold buffs you currently have the gold buff stacked up this way you can get a lot of gold from it because the first time i did it with no buffs i i only got like 400k this time i did a buffs I, I was i was getting close to 700k to 800k so super good here you get a lot of resource and like i said if you don't if you want to sell your loot you can as well it's worth a lot of money the loot that you get from here that's my kid that's like this max two mil right there Look, there's no one selling it. That means that that means that this is definitely being bought out. Splinter Gold. There is six of it for sale. I'm pretty sure someone bid on it because this one goes out quick. Yeah, this all on max. Like I said, these so much money, right? Ooh, this one's a lot of that. I don't know if that one's worth selling. Ruby's worth selling. There's not that much. Yeah, so do keep in mind, uh, these you can also sell your um other accessories and jewelries you get from within a goblin chest if you want to have more money instead. It's up to you, of course. But yeah, this does give you a shitload of money. If you have any more questions about the Goblin Wand, just leave it in a comment below and I'll get to you. Please make sure to leave a like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.